It was a dare. <laughs> you dared him to lay in a vat of cement at a construction site? He's not really our friend. Okay, you dared him to lie down in concrete. Nobody made him do it. You're making it sound like we did something wrong. <laughs> How long? What? How long did he lay there in that quick drying cement, yelling that he couldn't move before you called the police? Once his circulation opens up, the built-up toxins will stop his heart. I'm not usually the guy who's dumb enough to jump into a tub of cement for a girl. Wait, not the girl you came in with. You did this for her? The guys dared me. He was watching. She was watching. <laughs> and now not only is she totally unimpressed, but after I'm gone, she'll remember me forever. It's the idiot who was dumb enough to jump into a tub of cement. I'm the guy who died in a block of cement trying to impress a girl. Lola, Andrew's asking for you. Could you come with me, please? Is he okay? No, he's not okay. He's stuck in a block of cement. Wow, you care about him. He's my friend. I think he's more than that. And I think you're too proud to admit it to your friends and maybe even to yourself. He is scared, and he needs someone he knows to hold his hand. I can't help him. You're gonna hate yourself for this. Lola? Uh, she, I couldn't find her. Uh, she went to eat her or something. She just didn't want to come, right? <gasps> I'm sorry. Once, there uh, could have been a kiss, but I chickened out. Yeah, well, maybe you don't need to be kissing her. No. I do. My whole life is about kissing her. Let's go. Okay, we're gonna do this on three. One, I wash the leads. Two, three. There he goes. Clear his airway. Remember what I said about the bigger picture? Yeah. I've been waiting his whole life for that, huh?